Hey everyone, this is Alyssa from Mango Burst, and today I'm going to teach you guys how to make a gradient on Paint Shop Pro. Okay, so what you're going to do first is you're going to go over to your materials palette, which is right here, and you're going to click on either this one or this one. It doesn't really matter since you're just editing the gradient. I'm just going to click on the foreground one. So now this should pop up, and yours might be on color or pattern, so just change it to gradient. And so now you should have this window up. Um, to edit your gradient, you're just going to click edit. And now you set the gradient editor up. So now you're just going to pick a random one of these. It doesn't really matter, so I'm just going to pick this one. So this has two colors. If you want to add more colors, you just click once down here, and you add it a new color. And if you don't want another color, you just drag it off, and so now you only have two. I'm just going to add one so we have a three-color gradient. So now what you're going to do is you're going to to change the color, you're just going to click on the marker and you're going to click on the custom patch thingy right here. And so now your color wheel should pop up. I'm just going to change the color to red. So now it's like that. And you can also change the hex code color down here if you want, but I'm just going to keep it like this for now. So you're just going to hit OK. And you're going to same thing for these two. So click the marker, click this, and change the color. I'll make this one blue. Hit OK. And then for this one, just do the same thing. Click the marker, click the palette, and I'll just change it to yellow. Okay, and just hit OK. So now that you have your gradient right here, all you have to do is hit Save As. I usually save mine so I can use it in the future. And I'm just going to save this one as Test. And hit OK. So now your gradient is right there. So now just hit Close. And now you're back to here in your gradient, sir. You can also change the angle of your gradient. So right now it's horizontal, which is 90, but you can change it to 180 to make it vertical. I'm just gonna, I usually like keeping it 90. You can also change the style of it. You can change it, I usually do this one, but you can change it to the rectangular style, the sunburst circle style, and the radial style, so it's like that. So I'm just gonna keep it at um, the linear style, which is the horizontal style. So now that everything is set, you just hit OK, and your gradient is now right there. So the cool thing about Paint Shop Pro Gradients is I have two different size um, documents up. All you have to do is to fill them, you can just do the flood fill tool and click once for the gradient. And see, I did this um, document and it's a gradient, and I did this document and it's a full gradient also. That's the cool thing about Paint Shop Pro um, gradients. It doesn't matter how big your big or small your document is, um, you can just click the gradient and it works. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial and I hope it helped you guys. Keep checking back to my site Mango Burst for more tutorials and yeah, keep checking back to my site. Bye!